We'll start our burger journey at Ray's in Everett. And not just because that's where I grew up, but because Ray's opened their doors in 1952, and they've spent the last 50 years doing everything the same way they always have, including hand-cutting their fries. Hi, my name is Jeff Dolshell, and this is Ray's Drive-In. Family burger establishment. It's been here for 50 years. We're 50 years old this month. And my grandpa's Ray, he built it. My mother, Debbie Campbell, owns it. My brother and I run it. I have for about 10 years. Uh, I've been here forever since high school. At Ray's, I always see like fresh potatoes being turned into French fries type thing. It, everything is just quality. It's kind of like a hamburger you get at home. Well, they're kind of like the old days. The signature burger, the Ray's burger, uh, deluxe, you know, pickles, lettuce, tomatoes. Cooked great because I do it every day. What is it? It's a unique kind of a burger, I guess you'd say. It's like homey. I usually order a uh, cheeseburger with fries. The They just know what I like. I wouldn't change a thing. <laughs> I come in here on Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays in there. I don't want to make an extra day out of it. I come, I come down here Saturday mornings, too. Ranch burger with fries. And then second, I like the fish and chips. We uh, do real fish and chips, Alaskan cod. Uh, I cut it and batter it every morning, uh, fresh and white and delicious. Our fish and chips is my favorite. It's all handmade stuff, and we put a lot of time and effort into it. It's not pre-done like everybody else's, so like if you order it, we'll cook it right then and there. Uh, we do have some items off the menu that uh, we'll certainly uh, whip up for our longtime customers that we like a lot. Grilled cheese, you know, we're set up to slam out the burgers, buttering the both sides of the bread and getting the cheese to melt and not burning it. Uh, and I can do it, but some of the kids we're trying to train, having uh, them try and figure that out while they're cooking, it's, uh, it's a little difficult. My perfect hamburger, mushrooms, grilled onions, mayo and relish, lettuce, Swiss cheese with American cheese, pickles, real tomatoes, beet onions, and all the good stuff. All the good stuff on it. All the good stuff. As far as burger trends, um, I like to think of this as not trendy, <laughs> doing the same thing for 50 years. Can I go check and I'll come go back? Thanks. We'll let him get back to it. And in the meantime, we'll head to a burger place with its own county.